New jobs are opening up and people are getting back to work, but some industries are still taking a hit during the pandemic. Kansas prisons are joining that list as they struggle to find work. Fox 43 News Capitol Bureau reporter Rebecca Chung explains why. Finding workers has been an ongoing issue with jobs opening back up. And for Kansas Correctional Facilities, this can take a real toll as prison staff try to adapt. It's the same thing that every employer is facing right now, whether that's the restaurant industry or the manufacturing industry. State corrections officials in Kansas are calling it a unique time for employees and employers as they try to find workers. It's just really an employee centered job market right now instead of an employer centered job market. Kansas prisons took a major hit when the coronavirus pandemic began, seeing the number of open positions rapidly pick up this year. But we were 71 vacant uniformed officers a year ago. We're approaching 300 today, which is a about 13% of our uniform staff. Officials say less workers means cutting down activities for prisoners and longer hours for people on staff as they try to adjust to the changes. In two of our facilities right now, we've gone to 12 hour shifts instead of our standard eight hour shifts. So it definitely does make it more complex. State officials say the majority of openings are currently in positions for corrections officers, but it also ranges all the way to maintenance staff. Right now, they're encouraging more people to apply as they try to look for workers. At the Capitol, I'm Rebecca Chung.